Hey, this is Chad. I just want to give you a quick introduction to the new Big Patent Data Portfolio Visualizer, uh, which is currently testing in private beta. Uh, and the purpose of this tool is for uh, assessing and comparing the prosecution histories of different portfolios, uh, where a portfolio is simply defined as a list of applications or patents. Right. So here I've just sort of arbitrarily chosen Uber, Waymo, and Lyft. Uh, I looked in the assignment database. I simply searched by those words and the applications I found assigned to them is what is in these three portfolios. Not intended to be an exhaustive assessment of these three companies' portfolios. Just a quick example here. Uh, so the pie charts allow filtering on application status, application type, continuing application, and then the portfolio themselves. Um, then the heat map allows filtering by art unit. And then the bar chart allows filtering by disposition month, uh, order in disposition and by that I mean like let's say you wanted to compare the last 20 dispositions in these three portfolios right and then you can similarly do that for filing date right so this is filings by month and then this is order of filing and then finally priority date uh, priority by month and then order of priority so by interacting with these various charts you can then get out uh, allowance rate, actions per allowance, actions per abandonment for that selected subset of applications, right? So for example, if I only wanted to compare them on non-continuing applications, in other words, first US utilities, here we go. Um, again, this shows their allowance rate, but don't put too much stock into this. Uh, Waymo has obviously only assigned patents to uh, this entity, right? That's why this shows an allowance rate of 100%. Uh, but now let's say, oh, we only wanted to look at our unit 3660. And then now you're looking at that. And let's say, oh, we only wanted to look at file uh, applications filed since 2016. And there's that. So anyway, yeah, uh, you get it. And then right, the hundred sort of the hundred most recent results here are down. So once you get it down, let's say, right, for example, what's this application way down here? Okay, well that's that one. So this just sort of gives you 100 results if you actually want to dig into the actual applications, right? When you click this, it's going to pop open the uh, big patent data application inspector. Um, but again, portfolio can be anything, right? So another example is where the portfolio is uh, applications assigned to three examiners. So here I just chose three examiners from 3620, everybody's favorite art unit these days. Uh, and I actually chose them just because of how hilarious I thought it was that uh, if you look, right, like recently in Art Unit 3620, they have similar numbers of applications and just crazy different allowance rates, uh, pretty drastically different actions per allowance. Um, and so again, a portfolio can be anything, and this is just a way to help you compare them. Uh, and then, right, let's, so let's say I wanted to look at Examiner Coleman, and I wanted to compare him in 3620. Uh, since 2014, I want to look at, okay, what's his allowance rate overall? It's 6%. What's his allowance rate for non-continuing applications? Geez, only 2%. And But what is it for continuing applications? It is 18%, right? So... Uh, you're better off uh, <laughs> filing continuations with him, possibly. I don't know. Anyway, you get the idea. I hope someone finds it useful. And again, um, what I'm really looking for here is feedback on metrics that you want to see or how this thing can help make us all more efficient, better patent prosecutors. Thanks again for checking it out. Talk to you soon.